just finished a two-hour session. It was supposed to be one hour, <laughs> and then right when the one hour was coming up, they were like, can we, can I stay for another? And I'm like, yeah, sure, we can totally do that. Sometimes there's flexibility in my schedule for extending a session. And this one was really unique, it was beautiful. Ideal client, like hands down, beautiful, and that the client was able to um, ask for what they wanted, was able to, um, when there was something that they didn't like, was able to definitely correct, like, me, like I don't like this pillow, get rid of it, <laughs> right? Or my arm is starting to feel like it's going asleep, let's make an adjustment, like super advocating for themselves. It's again, ideal. Um, knew how to be quiet, when to be quiet, knew when it wasn't like time to speak or not time to speak, just was really taking care of themselves. But there was a moment, and it kind of goes to the topic, when they started to share what was going on inside, and the thought was this. I thought I was coming to this session to, to get out of, like, to, to leave my world, like to, to to lose myself, to, how did they explain it exactly? It was to not be in my, my world, like to escape, that was the word. They were joining the session to escape. And he, and he said, it's not like that at all in, in the session. This session isn't about escaping. This, he's like, I wanna be here. Why would I wanna leave this? I don't want to escape. I want to be here. It's allowing me to be completely present in this moment. And so I thought that was really interesting um, that this idea of like escaping, like do you go and get, when you get a massage, do you go to, to escape, right? Um, escape life. And to come to a session and find out like, wow, it's not about escaping. It's like I'm learning to be present in a way I haven't been present ever. and dropping the anxiety of doing stuff that like keep doing and, and it's like being really true to who you are being present being you so um that was such a like a beautiful personal revelation that i saw like that appeared in this client and just spoken so eloquent eloquently and you know, as the session ended, they, you know, they were like, you know, usually my instinct is to grab my phone and check everything and to be really anxious and like, and like, kind of like panic, right? Like constantly thinking like all the things I need to do and like what needs to be done. Like, it's like, I don't have it anymore. I can like go back into my world, check my email, not a big deal. Like it's there, it's not going anywhere. And just the, the quiet and the stillness of coming back to life in a new way. Um, yeah. A life was changed today so um, another person was put into the world where they can truly be present with themselves and with others so that's pretty much all I wanted to say and thank you so much for your attention and your love um, and in terms of I have Victor here is asking a question on Facebook live if I'm preparing for the hurricane I'm not <laughs> I'm being present in this moment it's sunshine it's beautiful outside um, no preparations here. Um, I'm sure everything is going to be fine. I'll have everything I need. And, you know, probably need to run to Costco. Thanks, Victor, for the recommendation. Probably need to head out there in a little bit. Um, but anyway, thank you all. Be Find ways to be mindful and present in your world. And if you need a session to find that, come find me. That's what I'm good at. Helping people really come into themselves and to their bodies. Turning all the unnecessary chatter right and unnecessary anxiety that like just takes over our minds just being here so thank you all take care bye bye